in a super sneaky way of avoiding questions that I don't know the answer to. Okay, so I have a lot of things coming up, girls. Um, next week is the musical. Um, we've got basically musical hell week from 3.30 in the afternoon to 9.30 at night, straight through, no breaks except for, like, dinner. Um, after that week, I have four days, and then I'm leaving for the state of Washington. Um, I think we're actually leaving on a Thursday, so if I, that, that's the start of my spring break. Um, Ash, I know you had yours, like, last week, or this week. Um, well, mine doesn't start until next week, or not next week, the week after. But, um, we get out that Thursday, and, um, we'll be leaving that Thursday from here to go there, um, so I might be able to make one when I get home because it's early dismissal, but if not, you're forewarned ahead of time, it might be late, or I might do it on an earlier day, I don't know yet. Um, after that, it's a pretty non-eventful April, except for I've got a band contest, and I have prom. Um, now, I mean, all of you ladies have boyfriends. Um, I don't anymore. Yeah, I assume you're going to prom with Pat. I feel like that's his name. If that's not his name, I am insanely sorry. Um... Ashley, I know you don't really do dances, but maybe you'll decide to go to senior prom because it's senior prom and you can go with your boyfriend. Um, Mo, I know you can't go to prom and that really hurts. That whole problem right here brings me to what I was going to bring up. So at the beginning of the video, I was actually finishing drawing a taco. See, my best friend Brian lives in a town 15 minutes away, and I am just busy enough and just far enough not out of high school that I have a curfew on weekends. But today is the day I was planning to ask him to prom because he's my best friend. Um, and I was going to go to Taco Bell and I was going to buy him a taco and be like, hey Brian, I have this taco for you. Do you want to go to prom with me? Which he already knows I was going to ask him. He just didn't know when. He didn't know how. He still doesn't know because my picture isn't sending. But, um, if it doesn't send, I'm just going to send him the link of this video and we'll see. Um, but I drew this. Um, it's got the lyrics to Wizards by Chaz Thug on it. And it says prom right there in case you are illiterate and cannot read. Um, which means that my song of the day is Wizards by uh, Chaz Thug. And if you don't know that song, please look it up. It's a really good song. Um, if you follow Luke Connard, he is really good friends with that dude. And that's how I found it. Um, so, yeah. I, I tell you what he says, but my picture isn't sending. So, I think I'm just gonna send him this on the computer. Um, if you want to know, I'll probably say it next week, or I'll probably just, like, say it on the Salt Eaters page, but, um, I really didn't have much else to say because I don't know how to answer Ashley's question, um, it's Hope Week at my school, um, there's this little boy who is also from that town 15 minutes away, uh, that Brian lives in, Washington, and, um, he, I don't know if you've ever heard of her, his name is Dax Locke. And he died, but, because he had cancer. But he really wanted to last till his last Christmas, because he really liked the Christmas lights. And it's kind of like a big thing now around here. So, um, if you looked it up, I'm sure you can find the story. I'm not going to say it all, but I am going to go. So, the STBA guys, I'll tell you what he says if he ever says anything, if I can get this to work. Bye!